Hi, my name is Sean. I'll be showing you a quick overview of Go Visually, the simplest and easiest way to get reviews and approvals from your clients and team members. This is the main dashboard. On the left side, you can see all your projects. If you are on our team plan, you can see and manage your team right here on the team members tab. Team members are your internal team members. They can create new projects and upload new designs and revisions. And over here on the right panel, you can see a list of all your clients and reviewers that you have invited to the project. As soon as you upload your proof, it is initially marked as needs review. And as the design progresses through the review process, it moves to needs changes, then to approved, and lastly, you can mark it as finalized. Go Visually allows you to upload a variety of file types from JPEG to PDF and even video files for review. When you click on a thumbnail, you'll be able to see all your designs within this project on the right sidebar. And here you can filter them based on their review status. You have a choice of three different annotation tools to mark your comments. You can choose between leaving just a comment, a box with a comment, or an arrow with a comment. So let's add our first comment. Comments that you place on designs will be visible to everyone invited to this project. You are also able to tag specific team members and bring their attention to a particular element that needs attention. Now, if you wish to have an internal conversation with your team members only, you can do that simply by marking your comment as team only. This is great for when you want to have an internal behind the scenes conversation hidden away from your client. Now let's invite some reviewers. On the main dashboard, you'll find the invite reviewer button. Opening this will give you two options. One is to copy the share link or two, you can invite them simply by entering their email address. When a reviewer first visits the link you've shared, they'll be taken to the latest design within the project. Here, they'll be able to view and reply to all the comments on this project. And if words aren't enough, they can also attach files with their comment. For example, a new logo perhaps, or an illustration file. The first time a reviewer places a comment, they'll be asked to identify themselves. So you'll know exactly who left the comment. The reviewer also has the option to mark a design as approved or requiring changes. If the reviewer requests changes by selecting needs changes, you'll notice the proof has automatically moved to the needs changes tab. Once you've worked through the project and resolved all the feedback, you can now upload a new revision. Simply select and click upload. Once a revision is uploaded, it gets stacked over the previous version of the file. The reviewer will be notified that your revision is now available. You can always go back and view all the previous versions of the file by clicking over here. Once you've uploaded more than one revised design to your project, you'll also have the option to compare previous versions side by side. When a reviewer approves a design, you can see that the tag shows approved and includes names of all reviewers that have given their approval. If reviewers haven't yet taken action, it's simple to nudge them by clicking on the remind button. Once you decide to finalize a design, you can click on the finalize button. This essentially locks the design from any further commenting or approval. Similar to working on a static graphic or asset, team members and reviewers can also annotate and comment directly on video files. Each comment is time-coded, so you know exactly where the comment is placed. You can also use tiny markers or flags on the video progress bar to navigate to the exact time stamp. You also have the option to switch between time code and frame count. 
The activity dashboard makes it easy for team members to see all activities from reviews to comments in a single glance. Go Visually also gives you the option to enable file downloads. You can enable this in the project settings. You have two options for file downloads. One is to allow downloads at any stage of revision or alternatively, only once the design is finalized. Reviewers or clients can then simply download the files by clicking on the download button. Finally, you are able to manage team members access to your project. By default, all project members have access to all projects, but you can control who has access by selecting specific team members. This is controlled in the project settings. Here you can select which team members have access to this particular project. Go Visually can also be integrated into other workflow applications, allowing you to get work done seamlessly. Automate your work with Go Visually and Asana, ClickUp, Trello, Microsoft Teams, Slack, Monday.com, to name just a few, and supercharge your business. I hope this has been useful. If you have any questions, we're available on chat anytime or shoot through an email and we'll be happy to help you out. You can also sign up for a free trial at govisually.com.